case known as Dobbs, started in the state of Mississippi. They Abortion's not going to stop. It's just going to be more dangerous and um, more, more difficult for women of color, mostly, to cross state lines. In a 15-week limit, the court finding that that law is valid and going further undoing about health care that this verdict goes down because a lot of places that were given abortion it was also taking care of women's everyday health care that they don't have it anymore roe versus wade what allowed that to happen is the fact that donald trump appointed three justices to this court no, i'm just absolutely enraged by everything that's going on right now the fact that we knew that this decision was going to be made before it was actually made and now we still have to show up and act like i don't know like that the world is normal People that are here. This is devastating news. Listen. I was crying tears of joy when I found out this has been by far the best news of my life. Um, it's just there's now hope for the women and children who have been hurt and killed by abortion. The culmination of all of that decades of work. Listen. I'm glad that I can be on the second kind of generation that can push this in the 50 states now. We're going to expand them. California and San Jose, too, are expecting an influx of women coming in from other states for abortion care in the wake of the draft. People inevitably um, will start coming to California um, in order to access abortion rights. Um, and I want to make sure that our community is still protected um, as opposed to kind of being exploited for uh, what I kind of foresee is going to be um, a potential uh, opportunity to make profit. Opinion last month. Um, the county board here unanimously allocated $3 million for a Planned Parenthood in San Jose to expand its reproductive care services. They also said between last July and March... I mean, I think we just welcome them. They're refugees. <laughs> they are, they're refugees. That's what we need to do. We'll, we'll pick up the slack. Um, pay taxes. We'll do what we need to. In a way, California would be picking up the tab for other states, right? Yeah, I mean, in, in effect, it, that will be the case, which is a whole nother set of legislative problems that I'm sure will come up. Um, yeah, it just, it, it unfairly redistributes the burden of that health care to, to states that are still, you know, pro-women. That Planned Parenthood already served 80 out-of-state patients uh, seeking abortion care, including many from Texas where the laws became more restrictive. Recent re President Biden using this essentially as a call for Democrats to get out and vote for lawmakers that will pass a law that will create a national right for women to have an abortion.